to welcome family and friends on the special day to the wedding ceremony of Nikki and Shane. I'd like to thank you all for travelling here to the beautiful Bridge House to celebrate with them in their commitment to each other as husbands. You've all witnessed and become friends and watched the relationship grow from mutual respectful friendship into a loving committed partnership to the point to where they commit in marriage to each other here today. So what is marriage? Well, a joyful marriage is never being too old to hold hands, is remembering to say I love you, is never going to sleep angry, is at no time taking the other for granted. To make this marriage work, however, will take more than love. It will take trust to know in your hearts that you only want the best for each other. It will take dedication to stay open to one another, to learn and to grow even when it's difficult to do so. It will take courage to honour your differences, to make the important things matter and let go of all the rest. And finally, it will take faith to go forward together without knowing what the future holds for both of you. Eight years ago, I found you, or rather you found me. In those first few weeks of romance, I learned of your caring, selfless nature. Your laugh and sense of humour was infectious. You were the light in my darkest hour and I learned that I didn't have to be afraid anymore. You gave me the confidence to be true to myself and for that I'm so grateful. Being with you made me feel for the first time in my life that I was truly living. In that short space of time I quickly came to realise that you were the one. And so today, eight years later, in the presence of all our loved ones, I'm delighted to commit myself to you fully and forever. I promise to be there for you no matter what challenge we face. I promise to put your happiness above mine. And above all, I promise to love you always. I am yours from this day until my last day. Shane, Shane, first off I'd like to say thank you because I am by far getting the better end of the deal today. Over the last eight years I have learned to grow with you and beside you. I no longer do what's best for me, I do what's best for us. You make me feel confident and comfortable of who I am. Life with you is just simply better. You have always been my rock, especially when my mum died and have been there for every major stage of my life. Thank you for always being strong for me in times I couldn't be strong for myself. I promise to always be committed to you and open and honest. I promise to continu continue loving your family and friends as if they were my own. I promise to let you take control sometimes and I promise to be yours forever. I honestly never thought I'd ever find true love. But here I am, standing here, making the easiest decision of my life. Like a man called Albus Dumbledore once said, happiness can be found, even in the darkest of times, if only one remembers to turn on the light. So out of this world, two souls have found each other. Nikki and Shane, may your home be a place of happiness for all who enter it. A place for growing, a place for sharing, a place for love. May those who are nearest to you be constantly enriched by the beauty and the bounty of your love for one another. May your work be a joy of your life that serves the world. And may your days be good and long upon the earth. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please be upstanding and applaud our newlyweds, Nikki and Shane Kelly. Thank <laughs> you.
light your days and warm your heart at home. May good and faithful friends be yours wherever you may roam. May peace and plenty bless your world with joy that long endures. May all life's past and seasons bring the best to you and yours. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. and Mr. Kelly! Woo! I love you. Oh. It's just right. It's like he 